high all if you come to the time when you're dealing with batteries so you need to have one of these charger and what is special is that Alito Kala is a good company with good products so let's unbox it and see what is inside we can see 2 amp 1 hour fast charging all in one I think that each channel is separated from the other one which means it's individually tested so let's open the box I will take all the things out so we have the manual we have a car cable and we have a power supply and then we have the charger itself there is a manual but I am not going to read it I never read the manuals okay as you can see we have eight slots the build quality looks pretty well I have to admit and also we have 9 volt to 9 volt slots and four buttons on the right side current pre prev next and mod preview probably and on the back side we can see that it works with 12 volt 4 amp minimum which means yeah of course if you want to charge each slot individually with 1 amp so uh, ah, you don't need a total of uh, 8 amps because the input is 12 volts but I think that yeah I think that 4 amps on 12 volt we can we can calculate 4 amp in 12 volt is 48 watt and then we need for each cell let's say about 4 watt so we have 4 multiplied by 8 so we have 32 watt and of course we have some losses on the DC and all the electronics but yeah 4 amp will be okay to charge all the slots in one amp there shouldn't be any problem with it by my calculation hopefully I didn't do any mistake and also the power supply that came with it is also yeah it's 12 volt 4 amp light to color if they write I believe them because what I've already checked with this company they are in good quality and what they are telling there I can say that it is true and they are standing behind what they are telling so let's plug it to power and see how it starts yeah so Okay, I want to show everything without any reflections. So we can see null. Null probably means that no battery is inside. So let's search for a cell. I have something here. Yeah, let's put a cell. And yeah, it is writing immediately the voltage and also the percentage 72 percent it is 4 volt and it is charging at a uh, half amp and the internal resistance also nice uh, if you see uh, one 128 milliohms that's this is nice let's try another cell that has a better internal resistance I think so let's try it here ah, how do I know yeah this is 3.55 and again 100 it can be that it is exactly the same so how do I go ah, I see here channel 6 and channel 4 ha 
they're both the same exactly resistance this is a little strange to me but let's see I will try to find another cell that I know that has ah, this is Dyson cell it's a copy of Dyson but resistance should be lower I guess no it always show 28 this is a little strange oh. <laughs> probably this is the, the min minimum that they have <laughs> okay and let's see if I can change the current yeah I can change you can see it is flashing uh, it's 300 milliamps half amp 700 and 1 amp okay the default is half amp okay but basically this is all it is also of course writing you can charge of course not just lithium cells but also nickel metal batteries let's see if it's really recognize it yeah nickel metal hybrid 1.3 volts and yeah it is it is charging and it is seems to work pretty well so that's all very good quality i will put a link in the description thank you and bye